Not a drop of rain in sight here, but farther to our north and west, we still have showers and thunderstorms that are just now brewing and becoming a little bit more intense. Quite a bit of lightning as well. Just to the north and west of Grand Rapids, you can see that here around Oshkosh and in portions of the UP. All this shower and storm activity slowly drifts across Lake Michigan and gets closer to us. But as it does so, it bumps into the drier air that's overhead where we have relative humidity at 32%. When it does that, those showers dissipate quite a bit on this computer model here. You can see by the time you join us at 11 o'clock tonight, we'll have showers and thunderstorms on our northwestern doorstep. But as they try to make it, make it into southeast Michigan, they basically disappear. All that water simply evaporates. But there's still at least a slight chance of a shower or thunderstorm in our west zone, closer to around Livingston County and, oh, and parts of western Washtenaw County, even the western portion of Oakland County. And the National Weather Service has a marginal risk of a strong or severe storm closer to midnight or shortly afterward. Now, the chances, I think, are very low, but they're not down to zero. So I'll monitor that closely for you as we go into tonight, especially especially during the overnight hours shortly after midnight. We're looking at 59 degrees overnight tonight. We're looking at mostly dry conditions across most of southeast Michigan, with the exception of those areas far to our west, west of Howell and west of Ann Arbor. Temperatures in the upper 50s to around 60 degrees in your neighborhood as well. Then as we go into the day tomorrow, we'll start off with some clouds once again. It gets warmer, feels like summer again, with sunnier skies in the afternoon, 72 degrees at noon, 79 for a high, and sunrise tomorrow morning is just after 615. Even warmer still on both Thursday and Friday with temps around 80 or more and more beautiful sunshine on the way. Now there's a better chance of showers and we need the rain by, by the way, of course, for those flowers that I just showed you earlier. Also for our lawns and gardens, chance of showers this weekend. Spotty, so no washout on Saturday, but a better chance of rain activity during Bookstock with temperatures in the 70s Sunday.